fires deliberately set in Hillcrest. People there worried their house will be the next one to catch fire in the middle of the night with them inside. 10 News anchor Brian Schlonsky shows us how the culprits may be hiding in plain sight. Well, that fire was eight months ago, and this house still isn't put together. And look at this. Just outside, another trash bin, torched. It's not easy to forget something like this. It's a little terrifying to know that there's somebody who's just doing this um, and really just targeting random people, it seems. Especially when it keeps on happening. I think it's really important for people to acknowledge that, you know, there's a lot of danger when it comes to playing with fire. It's not just a funny, it's not just a joke. It's not just random buildings either. There's people and belongings and pets inside. When flames tore through this Hillcrest house back in February, there were people inside. I'm not really sure why someone's doing this, but I'd like to say like you almost killed my parents and you're, you're really devastating your neighborhood. Whoever's doing this is devastating our neighborhood and knock it off. Pets too. Firefighters worked to save the family dog. That fire started in the dumpster outside. So imagine the horror for neighbors when they woke up today and found this another trash bin fire right where the last one happened. It's shocking. It's really scary to hear that there's something like that happening in the neighborhood for sure. Some people living nearby tell 10 News this is at least the third trash bin to be lit on fire in this alley this year. Some blame the homeless and the house where two people nearly lost their lives still sits as an ominous reminder that could easily happen again. Hopefully they can figure out who this person is so they can stop this from happening. We're working to talk with fire investigators to see if these fires are related. Reporting in Hillcrest tonight, Brian Shlonsky, 10 News.